Here's a quick tip for being able to set the open options for a PDF. Basically how a PDF will open when you open it or someone else opens it. Will it have the pages panel showing? Will it be full screen? You know, that sort of thing. So if you open up a PDF in Acrobat, it could be just about any version of Acrobat, come up to the file menu, you'll see something called properties. Now if you have an older version of Acrobat, it might be called document properties. Click on the menu item there and take a look at initial view it's called. We can set exactly what's going on with the PDF when someone else opens it, which is cool. This information, you guys, is actually saved with the PDF. So if I come to Navigation tab, if you only want the page, that could be a little more professional. You can say page only. If you're looking, let's say you guys have created something from Word or you made this big TOC or bookmarks, you can say open the bookmarks panel. All sorts of great things. I'm going to say page only. Page layout, this is a big one. You want to go single page or continuous. Continuous allows them to scroll and see multiple pages at one time. When I'm doing kind of a professional you know, type piece, I tend to go single page. You can also choose two up. This is if you have, let's say, a facing page document coming from Adobe InDesign or something like that. You can make it look that way. I'll choose single page. Magnification is usually pretty important. You can zoom in as much as you want. I tend to go and choose fit page. Now, it's going to fit the entire page, width and height in their screen. If you want them, I guess you could say a lot of uh, uh, letter size documents, you usually will do like a fit width or something like that so they can start reading right away. It's up to you. You've got to test these out, actually. So I'm going to choose uh, fit page. You can open it to any page in the document. Matter of fact, when I'm helping students out a lot or things like that, I'll, I'll open it to the page I want them to look at. This is the good stuff, but you got to be careful with this stuff, um, especially the stuff down here. The window options are pretty cool. You can resize the window to the initial page. That's the Acrobat window, which can be interesting, can be neat, I guess. You can center it. That's I do that a lot for, um, I guess you could say, a resume, that sort of thing. Open in full screen mode, that's for a full presentation. You want to make it look like a PowerPoint style presentation in full screen mode, go for it. They've got to know to hit escape to get out of that. Show, this is a good one. If you want to show the file name, that's default. You can also show the document title. That's showing right up here when somebody launches Acrobat and they open the PDF. The document title is found on the description tab here. So I could say, you know, Brian Wood or something like that. That's, you know, who I am. Whatever you want. Pretty cool, pretty neat. Take a look down here. So user interface options. Be very careful of these. If you hide the menu bar, if you hide the toolbar, if you hide the window controls, any of that stuff, people have to use shortcuts to get this stuff back. So it's kind of annoying. It's actually mean in some ways. <laughs> anyway, that's your open view or initial view options rather. So if I click OK, save the document. Now, when you just a quick tip here, if you're going to save a document, do a save as. Name it the same thing. Write it over the old one. Let me put this on my desktop. That way it won't add a lot of file size to it. That's the way we used to do it back in the day. Now, to test it out, I'm going to close the PDF and open it back up. I should see it under file right here. Now it's going to tell me I'm trying to go into full screen mode. It's going to t send just about anybody in the newer versions of Acrobat or Reader say this. I click yes. There we go. So now I've got a full screen mode document. I've got it exactly the way I want it. When I send it to somebody else, it looks exactly the way I want it. So not too bad. Pretty simple, easy way to make your document a little bit more professional.